What I want to do here is what I call real-time editing. What you see here is I have a clip from one of those little drone helicopters, and down at the tail end of the timeline, I have some B-roll and some slides. And uh, I'm going to rewind my playhead, and everything that you see from this point forward, once I hit play, will be happening in real time. I'm not stopping down. I'm not affecting the playback quality or the playback speed of the playhead. All right? So let's get going. This is, again, this is called real-time editing. So I will hit play, and as my uh, clip starts to play, I'm going to lay in some music from my bin, and then I'm going to bring in a title slide. The title slide will explain what we're actually doing here, and I think I'm going to dissolve in and out of that title slide. You can watch that happen. I'm going to make some edits in the mu in the in the music timeline. I'm actually making these edits just where I know that they'll work. I've put some markers there, but I'm going to take this measure and I'm going to loop it, and then I'm going to bring in some B-roll from the tail end, and I'm going to line it up at the beginning of that loop section. And actually, what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to fade the music there for this B for this uh, B-roll section, and then I'm going to put in some dissolves right there. And I'm going to put in another dissolve right here. As a matter of fact, I'm going to make this one um, a little slower. And actually, you know what? That shot with the, uh, we'll call that the powdered donut in the bathroom gag. That's pretty funny. So we're going to put that at the, I think that'll be a good closer. We'll put that at the end. And then we'll put some dissolves between all of those clips like that. Now let's bring in some slides from the tail end so we can explain what we've been doing here because this is our real-time uh, real editing. So we'll put some transitions between there, bring this clip in, we'll, we'll uh, shorten the audio, and let's do a little S curve on that. So we've been doing graphic overlays, adding transitions, audio editing, we've been reordering the clips, we've been changing the length of clips and so much more. Actually, let's do one more effect here. Let's just fade this out at the tail end. We'll do a nice slow fade. So that is what I call real-time editing. Thanks for watching.